Hey guys, what's up? My name is Jose Perez, and here you are in the beautiful city of Philadelphia. And today I'm going to be taking you on a tour of my university, the University of the Arts. Let's go, shall we? Here's our main building, the Hamilton Hall. And here is the Gershman Library across the street, alongside of Anderson. And the building where everything is at. Terra. And then we have a building dedicated basically for musicians. Merriam. Here you have the museum and even the Rocky statue located in the city of Philadelphia. It's not like any regular campus, you know, it's, it's basically a uh, city campus, so it's like a free roaming around experience, like, it's like a, like a college in, inside a city, you know, type of experience, so you get free to find yourself in, you know, like a business culture. There's also a great shopping area, so you see we have The Gap, North Face, H&M, Models, not even sure what that is. And then you have like a little mini mall. Next on the stop is 12th Street Gym, where we art students try to stay in shape. Most of us just play basketball. Um, the basketball here at U Arts is it's very intense, you know. Um, we have very competitive players, so. Everyone is trying to stay on the court and trying to win every game. So if you come here, it's, you better come. You better come with your A game and come hard. So not only is there basketball, but we also play another sport here: dodgeball. Not as popular as basketball, but it's still there. Next on our list, we have the dorms. This might look like Hogwarts, but trust me, this is our dormitory for Ness, connected to the Hamilton. Right around the corner, we have Pine. One of the better dormitories, we have Juniper. Then right up the street from that, we have Spruce. Here you can see the difference between the dorms inside the rooms. Some rooms are smaller, some rooms are bigger depending on how many roommates you have. I like being in a co-ed dorm. I like being around a group of people who are around my age who are also interested in art. Um, we have RAs, they have events. It's a very social life, you know. I was sometimes forced to be a little boring. You know how like in neighborhoods that can be a little boring for Sinella neighborhood, it can be kind of fun. Uh, this floor is definitely boring. <laughs> definitely. Yep. Um, but you just gotta make the best of it. I have a roommate, talk to him. Me and him are both the same major. Dwayne. <laughs> yeah. Huh, it's pretty cool. And I enjoy that. Have a good social time, you know, in here. Play a little video games. Like he got kind of a brother or a sister in every dorm, you know, it could be your worst enemy, but hey, let's think positive. One of our commuters talks about how it li feels to live off campus. What is my part? Uh, in my opinion, I think it's, it's nice. I think it's better than living in a dorm because I can have my own space when I want my own space. And when I want to have company, I just call them or something. I just go to the dorms and hang out with people. Now finally, the dining hall. We have two main dining halls. First, we have the one connected to the Terra building, Terra Dining Hall. Terra is more buffet oriented. Then we have our late night dining hall, Mangia. People prefer Mangia instead. We also serve fresh fruit most of the fruits are grown locally. In 
And for all those that don't eat around, we have local restaurants like IHOP, Dunkin' Donuts, Mahan Sushi, and Apollo's Pizzeria. Welcome to the academics of our school. I know what you're thinking that we're an art school, so we're going to have our art in there. But we also do do STIF, which is basically science and math, and we do have language arts class. But most of our classes consist of empty studios in which we can perform our art. Working our art, you see one of the students working hard on their animation. Well guys, thank you for watching my video, the Intro America Video Contest. I want to say thank you. Thank you for visiting my school and come back soon. About to be out because it's pretty cool right now. The weather's changing. See you guys next time.